Hello everyone, welcome back to Explore Electronics. In this video, let's understand number system and their conversions. We can convert one number system to other number system. Let us understand the conversion. Before going to the conversion, we have a four different number systems. As we know, we have decimal number system that we generally use in our day to day calculations. We have binary number system. This binary number system is used by the computer. The computer understands the binary number system. And also we have octal number system and hexadecimal number system. In computer languages, we are going to use these hexadecimal and octal number system to represent the binary number in a convenient manner. So octal number system and hexadecimal number system also important. So we need to understand the conversion from decimal to binary, decimal to octal, decimal to hexadecimal and other number system. So if you look at the table here, we have all the four number systems, binary number system will be having a base of two. Why we have a base of two here means the two different numbers we have in binary is zero and one. The next number if you are going to write, it will be the combination of these two. If you write the next number again, the combination of these two will be forming the next number. So we have only two individual numbers here. So with the base two, we are going to represent this binary. Similarly, if you look at octal number, octal number with the base is eight. Why here we have eight as base means we have zero, one, two, three, four, five, six and seven. So totally there are eight individual numbers. Suppose if I write the next octal number, again it is a combination of these two and it go on. So combination of these will be used to create the next numbers. Similarly, if you see decimal number as we use in day to day life, its base is 10. We have 10 different single digit numbers. Similarly, we have hexadecimal number system also. Here we have a base as 16 and also it will be represented as H. And this 16 representation because of there are 16 different single bit numbers and after 9 you can observe here A, B, C, D, E, F. So these total 16 numbers will be the base it is 16 and also we can represent that 16 with base as H but H is not a number in hexadecimal. It is representing H indicating an hexadecimal number. So these are the examples. A binary number can be having zeros and ones combination, octal number will be having 0 to 7 combination number, decimal number system will be having 0 to 9 combination, hexadecimal will be having 0 to 9 with A to F. So this is about the number system. Now we need to understand what is the equivalent number if you write decimal 0. It is binary 0, it is octal 0, it is hexadecimal 0. Similarly if you look at 1. Decimal 1 is same as binary 1, it is same as octal in 1 and also in hexadecimal. Then comes 2. If you write 2 here in the decimal, binary number will be 0 and 1. The next combination of that will be representing 2 that is 1 0. But in octal and hexadecimal we will be having 2 itself. Likewise, if you keep on writing the numbers, the equivalent binary numbers, octal numbers and hexadecimal numbers can be written like this. So let us understand in this video how to convert other number system into decimal number system. First let me take an example of binary to decimal conversion. So in my example I will be having a binary number like 1 1 1 1 0 0 with base 2. This 2 representing this is a binary number and also you can observe we have only 1s and zeros. Now I need to convert this into decimal number with base 10. So first I need to take this number. Here we need to number these digits with this is a zeroth number, this is the first number, this is the second, so this is third, this is fourth and this is fifth number. So always we need to keep in mind that the rightmost bit or rightmost digit will be the zeroth number. So this zero I am going to take first and I am going to multiply this with 2 power 0. Why? Because here we will be having a weight of 2 and this is the 0th number. So I am multiplying 2 power 0 with this number. 
plus I need to take the first number now the next one it is also 0 it is 0 into 2 power 1 similarly I need to take the next one 1 into 2 power 2 its weight is 2 plus next one into 2 power its weight is 3 plus 1 into 2 power 4 plus 1 into 2 power 5 this is how we can write a binary number in terms of decimal equivalent now it's just an multiplication and addition 2 power 5 into 1 it gives 32 this is 32 plus 2 power 4 into 1 it is 16 plus 2 power 3 into 1 it is 8 plus 2 power 2 into 1 it is 4 plus 2 power 1 is 2 into 0 is 0 plus 2 power 0 is 1 into 0 is 0. If we add all these it gives 61 this is the decimal equivalent for the given binary number. This is the method to convert binary to decimal. Let me take the second complex example where I will be having a decimal point 1.1011. Now this is the binary number I have. I need to convert into decimal. How to convert this? So here we need to observe that from the decimal point to the left we are start marking it as 0th number, 1st number, 2nd number, 3rd number like that. Here I will be having only one digit towards the left of this decimal point. So this is 1 into 2 power 0. Here let me put this decimal point as it is. From this decimal point onwards I need to go right. So this is my 1. 1 into this is 2 power minus 1. This is minus 1 number. This is minus 2 number. This is minus 3. This is minus 4. So here also next number is 0 into 2 power minus 2 we need to multiply plus 1 into 2 power minus 3 I need to multiply plus 1 into 2 power minus 4 I need to multiply. It is nothing but here 1 into 2 power 0 is 1 again dot 1 into 2 power minus 1 is what? It is 1 into 1 by 2 plus 0 into what is 2 power minus 2? It is 1 by 4 plus 1 into 2 power minus 3 in the sense it is 1 by 8 plus 1 into 2 power minus 4 in the sense it is 1 into 1 by 16. So if you multiply this 1 will be as it is dot the decimal point as it is this is 0.5 plus this is 0, 0 multiply with 1 by 4 is 0 plus 1 into 1 by 8 it is it gives 0.125 plus 1 into 1 by 16 it gives 0 0.0625. So if we add these let me write this one as it is 1.0687 this is our equivalent decimal number. Here we need to write the base as 10. This is how we can convert a binary number with decimal point to the decimal number system. Now let us go to the octal to decimal. So let me take an example of octal number. As we know octal number in the sense it will be from 0 to 7. There will be no 8 in octal. So 0 to 7 numbers are octal numbers. So let me take an example uh, 1, 2, 2, 5 with base 8. Now we need to convert that into decimal. So I am writing it as 10. So this given number as with base 8 that is octal. So again let me take in the same way. This is my 0th number, 1st number, 2nd number, 3rd number. Let me start with the 0th number 5 into what I need to multiply? This is base 8. So 8 power 0 is the weight for 5 plus 2 into 8 power 1 plus 2 into 8 power 2 plus 1 into 8 power 3. So here what is 8 power 3 into 1? It is 1 into 512 
plus 2 into 8 power 2 it is 64 into 2 it is 128 plus 2 into 8 power 1 it is 16 plus 5 into 8 power 0 that is 5 into 1 that is 5. So if we add these it gives 661 with base 10. This is the decimal equivalent for 1225 as octal number. Now let us take the next thing that is hexadecimal to decimal. As I said hexadecimal numbers are 0 to 9 and then we will be having a, a to f. There are total 16 numbers. So with the base 16 we are going to represent. So let me take an example of hexadecimal number. So let it be 7 a c with base 16. We need to convert that into decimal. How to convert this? Again this is 0th number, this is first number, this is second number. So let me take c into 16 power 0 plus a into 16 power 1 plus 7 into 16 power 2 right so here what is c so first we need to know single digit hexadecimal to decimal so let me write decimal and hexadecimal here decimal 0 is hexadecimal 0 1 is 1 similarly it will go up to 9 9 is 9 next if we write 10 in decimal it is a in hexadecimal if you write 11 it is b 12 is c 13 is d and 14 is e and 15 is f if you know these it is easy to convert hexadecimal to decimal decimal to hexadecimal so in this what i need to do 7 into 16 square plus a is what is a here this is 10 so 10 into 16 power 1 plus what is c c is 12 12 into 16 power 0 so now i need to multiply 16 square into 7 we have it gives 1792 plus this gives 160 plus this gives 12 so total is 1964 with base 10 this is how we can convert other number system to decimal number system.